It's a total closure tonight for one of the most crucial pieces of Paseo del Norte. Crews have shut down the roadway tonight near I-25 so they can start any big road realignment needed to finish the massive rebuild. News 13's Chris McKee is live at Jefferson and Paseo tonight with the details on what's going on. Chris? Crystal, crews have closed down about a two-mile stretch of Paseo here from Jefferson all the way west out to 2nd Street, and this closure is expected to last through the weekend. For drivers along I-25 tonight in North Albuquerque, Paseo del Norte basically doesn't even exist. We've been telling people to kind of try to avoid the area if you can. You can see it on this map. From Jefferson on the east to 2nd Street on the west, construction crews have now completely shut down Paseo del Norte. Until the closure is finished, drivers are being told to detour the east-west route by taking either Alameda or Osuna. That means no cars on that nearly two-mile stretch at all through Monday morning. So what's causing the mess? Work needed near the intersection of Paseo and Jefferson. All lanes will be shifted to the north. Crews will be moving all lanes of Paseo through the Jefferson intersection up several feet, a lane shift from between the railroad tracks to Domingo Baca. It's something that should feel very different for drivers. Westbound uh, Paseo del Norte will actually be like on the frontage road, and um, eastbound Paseo del Norte will be where the westbound used lanes used to be. But crews say that work will take through Monday morning to finish. NMDOT says this total closure of Paseo is much needed in order to finish the $93 million year-long mega project. Crews say they're expecting driver confusion will continue, but hopefully not for long. I think people will not be sure what to do at first, and so they'll be driving slower, maybe a little bit more backups. But once people get used to it, I think uh, traffic will go back to the way it was beforehand. Now here's a live look at what we're seeing right now. Cars moving through this intersection pretty well, but within an hour of this closure, one driver already caused a problem, hitting a construction worker, knocking him to the ground. I spoke to that worker. He says he's okay, but his co-workers took him to the hospital just to get checked out in case. Now crews are hoping to reopen this chunk of closed Paseo del Norte from here at Jefferson to 2nd Street at about 5 a.m. on Monday. Once it does, the rerouted lanes through Jefferson should last through the fall. Back to you. All right, thanks, Chris. Now, crews say they are still on track to finish the entire Paseo del Norte rebuild by the end of the year.